If you have issues with the Wi-Fi not working properly on Motorola Edge 60 Fusion, let me try to help you solve this issue. So first of all, we're gonna go to settings and let's open network and internet. Of course, you want to make sure that the airplane mode is disabled because when enabled, we cannot use Wi-Fi. Now, besides that, you can just simply turn off and turn on Wi-Fi. Sometimes this simple step allows you to fix some of the issues when trying to connect to your Wi-Fi. However, if that doesn't help, you can also go to the Wi-Fi option. And over here, what you can do is, for example, we can forget the network completely. But actually, I just thought about it before we do that, we can tap on this icon over here in the top right corner. This option allows you to reset your internet, including your Wi-Fi, of course. So after that, make sure to check if the Wi-Fi is now working on the phone. And also, before we actually move on further, make sure that the issue is actually on your phone only. Because if you have issues with the same Wi-Fi on other devices, this could mean that the issue is on the uh, router side or the Wi-Fi itself on that you have on your home instead of just the phone. But if you have issues with Wi-Fi only on your phone, then of course we're gonna proceed. So now what we can do is go to the Wi-Fi network that you are connected to or that you have been connected to and try to forget the network so that you of course forget the, the connection completely and you can try to reconnect. Now on the other hand, if the Wi-Fi is not available over here, on this list, you can scroll down in order to find safe network so you can remove the connection from here. So just forget the password, forget the network completely and try to reconnect. If this doesn't work, you can also go to network preferences and check if allow WEP networks option is enabled. If you have disabled it in the past or for example, by accident, etc. You can try to turn it on just for now in order to see if it makes any difference. However, if it doesn't, the last thing that we can do is go back to the settings. And now over here, let's go to, let me actually find it, try to find it. There we go, system, then go to reset options and we want to reset Bluetooth and Wi-Fi. So select this option and confirm that you want to do that. Unfortunately, these two things are connected. We cannot separate it. So if you decide to reset Wi-Fi, you also reset Bluetooth. So you have to reconnect to Bluetooth devices as well. But essentially now if we go back to network and internet, of course, you will need to reconnect to your Wi-Fi. But now it should actually work. It should be working. So just select your Wi-Fi network, connect again, and I hope it works. And that's it. Thanks for watching. Leave a like and subscribe to my channel and see you in my next videos. Bye.